Chief, you defied my instructions not to go out or engage in any workload. Doctor, you don't expect me to lie around here doing nothing. Chief, but you have capable hands running the affairs of the companies. If you do not restrain, I am sorry, other complications will arise. And I do not know if your heart is capable to bear the pants for another surgery. Ma'am, you are a doctor, and I am sure you know exactly what I'm talking about. I have been talking to him. He won't listen. You want to force me into a an, an retirement? If I have to force you to a retirement, for you to be healed and hurt, I will. Because you have a capable man, for goodness sake, to run the affairs of Namani's dynasty. Chief. Get out. You heard him the last time we talked about it. That young man has no interest in the Namani's dynasty and you know it. It doesn't matter what he wants. This is a necessity and his opinion is inconsequential. This family has been running on a relay race and his won't be any different. Dillion is your successor. And you know the rules. No right, no seat for him as the head of the dynasty. Well, what needs to be done will be done. He has to do what has to be done. We all know the way it went last time. Well, this time, it will be different. I am going to arrange a conference call with Dillion and Laura. Go and prepare the household for dinner. Why are you this excited? Delia, it's coming back from the UK! Hey, 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 hey. Shush, shush. That's not true. And even if what you say is true, why must the information come from you? I mean, why must you be the first to know, huh? <laughs> hey, Miss Blogger. Low budget Linda Ikeji. We know you know it all. Hmm? But I'm sorry to bust your bubbles, darling. This particular information eluded you this time around. <clears throat> Dillion is coming back from the UK! <laughs> and, hey, and why are you jumping like a frog, like he's coming back for you? Of course he's coming back for me! Uh-huh. He is coming back for me. In your dreams. <laughs> Don't I have what it takes? To be the next Mrs. Namani. Uh -huh. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, the pepper in the food I'm cooking in the kitchen is choking me. Is choking that me. pepper that would kill you there? <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, I don't mean to be rude, but if anyone should have a shot at Dillion, that woman should be me. <coughs> <coughs> What's funny? Are you remaining somewhere or this? Oh my god. Listen up, listen up, listen up. Your girls are living in fool's paradise. Mm -hmm. I mean, do you realize the caliber of man we are talking about here? Mm -mm. Tell us. I'll tell you, my darling. Mm -hmm. A fifth generation multi millionaire. Oh, yeah. The son! An heir apparent to Namani's dynasty. Does that ring a bell? <laughs> it does not ring a bell. <laughs> Miss Blogger, Madame Forbes magazine. Tell us what we don't know already. Yeah. So you know. So why do you choose to remain gullible? Huh? Biachas, Abi Man, or whatever you call yourself. Don't insult me. We went to university. So don't even try to use grammar to confuse me. What, what was the meaning of that one now? A queen, a hotel, a queen, they may understand. Just, 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 just leave, stop it there. Um, um, 
Chelsea, yes. Or whatever you call yourself. Shush. What makes you think that Dillion cannot fall for us? Because you girls do not have the requisite class, the poise, the confidence mm. to be Mrs. Namani. Oh. 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 <laughs> Chelsea, you're a very funny character. <laughs> <laughs> so, is it you now that is standing here? Abi, you remain inside. You're wrong, me and my sister. <laughs> is it you that has the requisite class to become his wife? Of course, my darling. Oh. I am a graduate of the prestigious downtown university Mom. of science mm. and technology. <coughs> a member of the alumnus of the same great institute. <laughs> <laughs> you have seen me now. I'm a graduate of the uptown university of my father's village. <laughs> Maybe. Who knows? Eh? You forgot to add that you're a master's degree holder in, in, in washing plates and, and, and wearing big shoes. Whatever. You know what will kill you? is jealousy. Yes. You always ooze of jealousy because you know you can't even measure up to my standard. As a matter of fact, you are not even up to my shoes. So girl, choke on it. You know what? I don't blame you. You see this job? Mm. It's temporal. With time, I'll take a walk. Abia. Uh, well, if you ask me, I think we all should stop quibbling and get into a contest. And let's see who get picked. By Dillion. Beautiful. Let the contest begin. You're just wasting your time. Una, they're funny me. Una, really, they're funny me. Wait, wait. You all want to go into a contest? Of course. For a man you don't even know if he's coming back to Nigeria with another woman. Mm-hmm. And, madam, I know it all. Chelsea. What gives you the impression that there are no such ladies? What did she call it again? Class Poise mm -hmm. and class. Uh, Requisite class. Yes. Mm -hmm. In the UK, that you will fly over 6,000 kilometers mm -hmm. just to come get who? You. I'm special. Hey, oh. Chelsea. <laughs> Wait. You all have common problem. And you know what that is? Long throat. Long throat is your problem. You've stayed long enough in corridor of wealth. That makes you all think that you have a room here. You know what? Go back to your duties and stop gossiping. What's calling Ketu? Uh -huh. <coughs> Daughters of Jezebel. A1 in gossip. F9 in common sense. What are you gossiping about? Instead of you to invest your time to develop yourself, you sit around here, eat and gossip, fools. And you, the very one with POP on our legs, I'll take care of you, idiot. It's not Madame Kweko that asked me to leave the room. Why? Because she doesn't want me to listen to what she was telling Madame. What could she be telling Madame that she doesn't want someone else to hear? I think it has to do with finding a wife for Dillion. But why would he be looking for a wife for him when he can't do it himself? Exactly! My question exactly! Why would they be looking for a wife for him when I'm here? You know? <laughs> when you're where? When, when I'm you're here! Tora. I think you should go back to what you were doing before. Eh? Then standing here and wallowing your own foolishness. Don't oh. you think? So you call this foolishness, Abby? But that is it. No problem. Just wait until I become Dillion's wife. By that time, 
you'll be begging to have a word with me. Don't really? worry. By that time, I will be the wife to the president of this country, you know, right? <laughs> Dreamer, keep dreaming. You're getting dressed already. As you can see. But I'm here to get satisfied. I didn't come here to get you satisfied. I came here to get laid. <sighs> come off it, Chelsea. Stop the pretense, okay? I know you love me and you get into my arms whenever you want to. So why acting up? Please, don't think so highly of yourself, all right? Anyways, I don't have time for all this your nonsense. Are you, expect are you expecting anybody? No, I'm not. Did anyone see you walk into the room? How am I supposed to know that? Huh? You are summoned. Is everything okay? Yes, everything should be fine. Don't ever want to get caught. If anything happens, I'll just I'll kill you. You put yourself here now to you. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. I summoned you here to inundate you about what to expect in the coming week. We would be playing host to Dillian, who is later to return and take over the affairs of his dynasty. So I expect each and every one of you to be well behaved and well dressed. If I find anyone wanting, especially you, the girls, I would not hesitate to send you back to the trenches where you belong. And you know that I have the powers to do that. So, I would not tolerate laxity, gross misconduct, or gossip around here. Have I made myself clear? Yes, yes ma'am. Now get your stupid and poverty shrinking self out of my sight this minute. Get out. Maurice? Yes, ma'am. Get me a glass of water. Okay, ma'am. to Dillion, who is slated to come back to take over the affairs of things in and around here. <clears throat> if any of you, especially the girls, you yeah. and Chelsea, not me, <laughs> if any of you is found wanting, I will not hesitate to send you back to where you came from. <laughs> <laughs> you forgot the gossip part. <laughs> 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 uh -uh, let me do it for you. <clears throat> <clears throat> she went like this, she said, <clears throat> Be about your duties, as I will not tolerate 
any form of laxity, unnecessary gossips, and uh, uh <laughs> you're not here as Jared. <laughs> oh, Vasabi. Oh, Vasabi, don't go kiss Stella. I swear, ever since she was made the chief domestic staff, she has been thinking, carrying herself like the madam of the necklace. your pain, mm. all right? But trust me, all this will end soon. <laughs> Ow! Ow! Chelsea. Question. <laughs> when I become Mrs. Dillion mm. Naman, I will ensure that you girls are adequately taken care of. Oh, it's not adequate. <laughs> Sorry. 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 Right on with your speech. Right Sorry. on, ma. <clears throat> As a matter of fact, mm -hmm. I will ask my husband Ew. to increase your salary and promote you. Oh. <laughs> you got <laughs> You girls can laugh all you want, mm -hmm. but believe me, it will happen soon. Very. <laughs> please, when you become Mrs. Dillio, please, 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 Mrs. Dillio, become. I'm not asking for too much. Mm -hmm. Just make me your PA. Happy? <laughs> I don't even know. You don't want anything. I don't even know the one I want. Jim Rice. Me? Chief of staff, exactly. She? B.A. She? Me? She? Me? She? Me? She? Me? She? Me? Ah, ah. Sorry. Mrs. Dillion. Chicken, sorry. No, man. Oh, the last time I did. Business, I shouldn't come. Oh, the struggle was gentle. Well, here we are. We're about to feed the same lady.
Okay, Chief. I will do just that. I have to be on my way now, Chief. No. My business. Good day. You must be Diamond. Yes. <laughs> you are indeed Diamond. Oh, thank you. <laughs> so how is your fashion business? Fashion. Aren't you? Uh, of course. <laughs> you know, fashion business is going on well. And if you must know, I love making dresses for renowned, influential, beautiful, high class women like you. <laughs> so I've got a double package. A daughter-in-law. And a fashion designer. You can see all in that one. Me? All in one. <laughs> yes, actually. Thank you. Lovely smile. Thank you. Oh wow. Um, Ma. Yes. The table is set. Just in time. Let's go and eat. Food is ready. Okay. <laughs> That takes it a lot. This wine is made in Dubai. Dubai, right? Mm -hmm. Togo. Mm -hmm. Maybe Togo. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> mm. Savant. <laughs> Savant. Savant. Pick this thing up. Pick it, pick it. Pick it up. Jane, this is not a laughing matter. Can you imagine that small girl asking me to pick up the towel that she used in wiping her smelly mouth? 
Just imagine. She did it on purpose? Of course she did. Wow. If you ask me, there is trouble. How do you mean? Our individual plans to get Dillion, marry any of us, may have come to an end with the arrival of that girl. Impossible! I can't allow that nitwit have a chance with my Dillion. Not in this life, not even in the next life. And that nitwit, that nitwit happens to be the only daughter of Chief Magnus Diwibe. Does that name not ring a bell to you? I don't care if she is Dangote or Otedola's daughter. Mm. That brat, or nitwit like you called her, is no match to me. Come on girls, take a good look at me now. Eh? Oh. Eh? Look at me, full of Sean. I can cook, I can sweep, I can clean, I have sense, I have Inkiruka and Azuka to back it up. Does that not make me a complete wife material? One million yards? Oh please. <laughs> I am Chelsea. The exclusive reserve of the rich, mighty, and influential. <laughs> influential? Mm -hmm. Just like Fred Abbey? <laughs> Fred? Hey. Well, every woman has a Fred in her life, right? You mean to say... Every woman has a free service in Kunkumba. Take it Very important. Thank you so so much for the dinner. I <laughs> really enjoyed myself. Well, it's good having you. <laughs> so we look forward to seeing you again soon. Yeah, sure, absolutely. All right. All right. You take care of yourself. All right. Okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay. All right. right. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. What do you think about her? Does she have the qualities required? Well, physically, yes. But it remains to be seen, you know, what she has to offer on the inside. Well, ma'am, you don't need to worry. She has a good upbringing. And I'm sure Dillian will love her when he sees her. Oh, speaking about Dillian and his eventual return, how far have you gone with the preparation for the gala night? Oh, I have everything drafted out. I think you should come see it. Okay.
Are you still on this? Uh, yeah, yes, ma. I, I am almost done. For how long? Listen, I will not tolerate such lackadaisical like attitude here. Okay? Everything around here has time, and you must keep to it. I'm sorry, ma. Rubbish. And, and what do you have behind you? Ma? Um, my, my hands. Damn it. I mean, what is in those stupid hands of yours? I, 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 um, I, Hello, ma. Um, okay, right, right away, ma. I'm not done with you yet. mind that stupid Stella. Very soon, you will be mine. I'm mine in the I love you. The drum is for Dillian. For Dillian. For Dillian. For Dillian. For Dillian. For Dillian. Oh, the this drum is for Dillian. For Dillian. For Dillian. I know you would be whispering among yourselves, asking questions like, who is she? And why is she here? Well, let me formally introduce her to you. Her name is Diamond Diribe, the daughter of Chief Magnus Diribe. She's not of your class. Mm -mm. Don't go there. Where in a matter of weeks, she would be assuming her conjugal duties as the wife of the sole hair apparent of Namani's dynasty. And you were mandated to respect her to the letters. If she for any reason complains about mistreatment from any of you, I would not hesitate to sought the permission of the madame of the house to send you all back to the trenches where you belong. Am I clear? Yes, ma'am. Yes. Great. Dear madame. Would you want to add anything to it? Um, you know, <clears throat> anyway, you all should just keep being the, the humble servant. Servant, shut up. Servant. <laughs> and try not to get under my, my Melanie delicate skin. That's all. That's all. Now let me break that to your level. She said you should not get under her delicate Milani and expensive skin. Is that clear? Yes. yes now get your half-baked selves out of my sight. Now. Right now, please. Thank you. Get out. Forward. March. Out. 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 Gossip out. We are fully baked. Half baked gossip. I'm not even baked at all. Get out. Look at her. Oversized boots. Get out. Busy no, body. Come on now. My darling, would you that. want something to eat or drink? Yes, so. I'm hungry. Don't worry, it's just a call away. It's rice, ma. You must be very stupid. Of course I know this is rice. I mean, what kind of a Tesla's food is this? Aha. Uh -huh. He brought poison for me to eat. No, no, you want to kill me. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> poison? Uh -huh. Ma, there's no poison in this food, though. I don't understand. What do you mean there's no poison in this food? Oh, oh. Are you trying to say that I don't have a test board? No, you're trying to call me a moron, a fool, that I, I, 
I'm not able to differentiate what is what tastes good and what doesn't. Hmm? This is obviously poison. I mean, even an animal can't even survive this. Hmm. Let alone a uh, human being like me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is poison. There is no poison in this food. I, I've been cooking in this house for a very long time and nobody has ever complained of my food. Even governors and presidents have, that come to visit Oga in this estate, I've cooked for them as well. I've not had a, 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 any complaint. Wow. You don't know what you're talking about though. Bravo. Chef. So you're proudly telling me that you've been feeding this household with rubbish. Huh? Ma, my food is not rubbish. My, my food... What do you mean your food is not rubbish now? Who can survive this food? Ma, my food is not your rubbish. Your food is rubbish. Don't tell me that. This food is rubbish. Who can survive this? Now, nah. look at me. I can't even swallow it. You know what? You're insulting me. You're calling me a liar. And a fool. But you know what? I am going to report to Stella. <laughs> Stella must hear this. My not insult. That you brought poison for me to eat. My I'd not insult you. I'd not insult you, but if you want to go and report to Madame Stella, no problem now. Go and report now. No problem. This is eat that one. No problem. Eat it. Bring that food back. Can you bring it back? So you have the food. Yes. Stella, I didn't insult. Excuse me. What did you just call me? No, say that again. Chief of staff. I didn't insult her. She, only, she, she, she was the one who said my food was, was, was tasteless and poisonous. I wasn't good for animal consumption, let alone a human being. That's so I had to true. take it away. It's not true. I mean, I only pointed out few things that was missing in the food and then she got angry and took the food away hey yeah you're lying now how am i lying are you you're calling your boss's fiance a liar really okay fine i will let this slide this time but the next time it repeats itself again i will send you back to the trenches where you belong now go right in there prepare her a fresh meal and make sure this time around is tasty now get out out Get out! What if she doesn't like the food when I make it? It means that you are stupid, useless, and irrelevant to this dynasty. And that means you have to leave. So go and prepare a fresh meal. Get out! Get out! Stupid girl. And please sauce it well. Look at her. Oh my dear, I'm sorry. You know, they just sit around here, eat, consume food that they can't even eat in their houses and grow big like, like fools. I'm sorry. Mm. She makes something nice for you. Oh. How did it go? Can you imagine that stupid girl that calls herself Diamond that be bronze that be whatever her stupid name is? Telling Madame Koi that she never said my food was tasteless and poisonous. That she only pointed out what I should have done. <laughs> But I think I've suffered. That she only pointed out what I should have done to have made the food taste better than it was. Just imagine that kind of stupid talk. You know, the very first day I set my eyes on her, I knew she's going to be a trouble to all of us. Hey, all of you, not me. She tries that nonsense with me. I'll so beat her and damn the consequences. You would risk your job. What job? I don't care about the job. If she tries that nonsense with me, I will show her why they call me Chelsea. Wait and see. Just watch. Ah. So, did you make her another food? Yes, I did. But I wish I put poison in that food so I should eat it and die. She should not worry. Another time is coming. Ma'am, 
I... Hey, uh, I mean, can't you greet? Oh, I'm so sorry, my greetings. Mm -hmm. Servant, what do you want? Ma, I came to tell you that I've been seeing the way things are going around here, right? Especially between you and Dora. But I've come to tell you not to mind them. Yes, they are only jealous of you. They are jealous of the fact that they cannot even get up to your fingernails. Alright? Amongst all of them, I am the most educated one here. And I have chosen to be by your side. Alright? The whole thing happening here is steaming jealousy. Jealousy inside poverty. Yes, ma'am. Poverty. So, if I understand the rubbish you're trying to say, do you want to be my eyes? Exactly, ma'am. And my ear? Mm -hmm. In this estate? Yes, ma'am. Well, that's a point worth considering. But if I may ask, at what price? Price? Mm -hmm. There's no price, ma'am. I just want to do the right thing by standing with you. Anyway, I'll think about it. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you for giving me the opportunity at least. Why did you wake me up? Why are you sleeping by this time of the day? Is it your business? I'm not special are you holding close to your heart. None of your business. None of my business. Mm -hmm. mm. Why are you dressed like this? Oh, in case you have forgotten, Dillion is on his way back to the country. <laughs> Your twin has arrived. Yes, and we need to get you prepared to receive them right now.
I told your mom that yeah. I can still run, but she won't take it. She wants the best for you, Dad. My goodness! My goodness! Oh my God! What? The lion! God! The lion! Who is this? Hey! Do not try to take my shine. Step aside. Mm. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> my name is Oscar from Alabama. And trust me, you owe me quite a fortune for taking care of your son. Will that house to me? <laughs> your friend really has a great sense of humor, you know. Yes, yes no, I you have not seen Oscar. Here. Oh, mommy, mommy, mommy. Oh, mama. Look at mommy. And look at daddy. Yes. Look at them looking like vampires. Uh -huh. Come on. Uh -huh. <laughs> and I have to take good pictures of you guys. Oh, oh, to show my yeah. friends in the States. Why is that? Sorry, sorry, sorry. The lion. This is a country home. You have mosque. You have church. Yes. You have library. <laughs> in your house. Of course, everything. Everything. All right, can we all? Go the lion. The banquet is ready. Come on. The lion. The lion. The lion. You have ATM machine in your house. ATM machine. Let's go. I am not going back to Alabama. <laughs> Good thing you all. Um, sir, here are the staff in charge of the day-to-day -day running in this estate. Um, so what about the ones I met here in the Dr. Michael's staff? Oh, they have all been relieved of their duties. Oh, I see. Any problem? Uh, not at all, sir. Um, Obi and Fred would meet you when they return. They are on an errand. Obi and Fred, okay. Um, this is Maurice. He's in charge of the security unit. Oh, Boris, right? Yes, sir. You're welcome, sir. Thank you. Here is Dora. She's in charge of food and she cooks sometimes. Ooh, my most special um, department. You're welcome, sir. Thank you. And here is Olivia. She's in charge of the chores. Ah, how are you, Olivia? Olivia! <laughs> I'm sorry, you're welcome, sir. You're welcome. Um, here is Frank. He's the butler. And who's she? Um, her name is Good day, ma'am. Good day, sir. I'm so sorry for coming late, please. Pardon my manners. So, who are you? My name is Chelsea Neoma Chuku Mary J. A graduate of Fine and Applied Arts from the prestigious Downtown University of Science and Technology. I am the chef in charge in this estate. My culinary skills are second to none, as I have cooked for President Macron of France and no, also... No. Just enough. Um, one more thing, sir. <laughs> On behalf of the staff of Namani, I present to you this beautiful gift. <laughs> right? <laughs> right? Step aside. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, you're you're welcome. Welcome. I, I appreciate. Thank you all. Oh, you're welcome. Oh, you're welcome. Sir. <laughs> what was the meaning of what you did back there? What did I do? You see? Pretender. Now she's acting like she doesn't know what she did. Chelsea. Yes. Why did you have to make us look stupid before Dillion? Stupid? Yes. You still haven't made any talk. Wait, wait, shut up. Shut up. What was the gift all about? Mm -hmm. When did we discuss gifting Dillion? Exactly! When? When did we discuss that? You have no right to tell me to shut up. Really? Do you hear me? Really? Yes. And as for the gift, let me remind you girls that we are in a contest. 
And what you saw over there is my own creative way of getting the man after my heart to look my way. All right? So, so wearing short skirts and big boots, they're not enough for you again, mm -hmm. Abby. You had to go out to get gifts without even informing us. Mm -hmm. You think Dillion will fall for something that cheap? <laughs> huh? Cheap or not, the most important thing is that he noticed me. And that is what I call progress. Shove it down your throat. You see? He noticed me. You see that? In a cheap way. <laughs> and you think he will respect you. Okay. <laughs> No problem. Can you imagine? We'll just use you and dump. It's in a you cheap way. Oh. I just, I just feel like squeezing this girl. I feel like, I feel like squeezing her. You need a mid person the vest. So no problem. We Let's shall see. Down. No problem. We're sitting down. We'll soon come and catch him. And then we'll catch him. No problem. Let's go. <laughs> yes, my dear. You can see that again. I mean, Nigeria is a beautiful country. You can easily. I mean, where you can easily get hold of our. Local dishes here and there. Mm. Unlike Canada, my dear. The last time I traveled to Canada, I found it really difficult to get hold of our local delicacies. Really? I tell you, like I did like this. I searched everywhere. <laughs> it was really hard. Yeah. Well, we have our own delicacies over there in America, but it's not as delicious as the one prepared here. Yeah. Yes, yes, I agree with you because, I mean, the last time I traveled to Dover and in Germany, I, I, it wasn't all that hard for me to get um, uh, Eba and Oha soup. Yes, it was just like, <laughs> I just found the restaurant the immediately. In Germany? <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh, sorry. Doban in uh, uh, Switzerland. <laughs> yes, Doban in Switzerland. I mean, Doban it... is not in Germany or Switzerland. Doban is on the island. Wait a minute. Yes! <laughs> oh my goodness, sorry, pardon me. Yes, my bad. My bad. Yes, my bad. Aha! Toban is an. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, you know, I have traveled so wide that um, I tend to use the cities interchangeably. You know, yes. Toban, England. Yeah! So, anyway, I, I ate a lot. The barn is not in England, the barn is in Ireland. What is wrong with you? What? Do you want to ruin this rare opportunity for us? What are you talking about? What am I talking about? I had you went in there to embarrass yourself. Talking about a city you know absolutely nothing about. Do you even know the caliber of people we are dealing with? Do you? What wrong did I do? I, I, I just wanted to, you know, feel among. I just, I just wanted him to, to see me like classy, like I have all it takes to be his wife, you know? Listen, you don't have to play to the gallery to make him see you as classy. You are beautiful enough, just be natural and let it flow. Oh. It's not just oh, it's not a matter of oh at all. Don't ruin this chance for us, don't, because I won't take it. I've heard you now, I've heard you. <laughs> Moreover, Charles has been calling me. And who is Charles? Ah, Charles my boyfriend now. You're asking me who is Charles. What does he want? I thought I'd ask you to block him. Do you know what? Give me your phone. Your phone. I don't give, understand. Me, give me your phone. Oh, what does my phone have to do with this now? Ah! You'll get a new phone and a new SIM card before the end of today. I don't want you to ever contact him again. Rubbish. Ah! iPhone 13. It's very funny. All this drama every day is funny. Yeah, the drama is for the neon, for the neon, for the neon, for the neon. All this drama is for the neon, it's for the neon, it's for the neon. These girls not busy body Seduction doesn't work no more That fashion is old Because men are now wise I guess that should be Laura Oh, really? 
Pretty good, sir. Good. Hmm. I can see you're getting ready for the party. Yeah, actually. I don't know what you're wearing. Oh, really? You do? Yeah. <laughs> it's a choice you. of color, actually. Thank you. Uh, let me help you with that. Okay, and thank this. you. I thought I fixed that already. Yes, but it's not properly fixed. Okay, thank mm -hmm. you. You look so cute. Hey, come on! What's that about? I don't understand. I mean, I, I thought we were together. I, I thought we were lovers now. Lovers? You don't even know me. I don't even know you yet. Come on. I mean, what is there to know about you? Um, hey, 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 hey. Stop. Okay? before bringing anything. I'm sorry, sir. Thank you. I mean, what is, what is this you're wearing? You don't know what I'm talking about. I mean, what is this you're putting on? I... I honestly don't know. Oh, please! Just get out. Get out! Did you just see that maggot? Um, what was that for? Exactly! that for? No, I'm asking you what was that for? Don't tell me you didn't see what she was trying to do. I mean, this girl was trying so hard to seduce you. Hey, come on, you don't say something like that. Say something like what? It's crystal clear. But don't worry. I know how best to deal with them. Hey. Hey, hey, no, no.
Ladies and gentlemen, a very warm good evening to you all. A round of applause for yourselves. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Greg Odinukwe, and I shall be acting as your guide through this monumental occasion. A round of applause for all of you. Guys. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, without wasting much of your time, please. Allow me to introduce a man to you. Not just any kind of man. A man I call a superman. A man responsible for the assemblage of these beautiful and wonderful men and women here today. A philanthropist. A man of the people. A man that has touched life. Whose gesture has endured has helped a lot of poor Nigerians, not just that. He has affected lives throughout Nigerians. Ladies and gentlemen, he is a giver. A man that people eat today is because of him. Ladies and gentlemen, he is the CEO, Chairman, Bat Oil Company, Nigeria Limited. He is the Chairman and the caretaker of Namami Dynasty. A round of applause for this man. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, and his very beautiful wife, Dr. Emilia Chinkezile Namami. You can see the beautiful daughter. And his only son, Dillion Chukwe Meka Chinkezile Namani. Chinkezile Namani. His wife to be, and his wonderful friend. Oscar, all the way from Alabama. Now, Alabama. 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 You're welcome. You're welcome, sir. You're welcome, sir. You're welcome, ma'am. Gentlemen, distinguished ladies, please, you may have your seats. Let me go straight into the order of the day. Allow me to call on Reverend Desmond Anyamo. As he leads us in a very short prayer. Brother. Please. A round of applause for him. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. Let us pray. Our Father in heaven, we thank you for this moment. For us all to see the light of this day together. We have all gathered together here to celebrate a man. Man who has put laughter, happiness, and joy in the lives of many. We ask, O oh God, that thou strengthen him and his entire household. We pray, Father, thou bless him with wealth, more wealth, and wisdom, knowledge, and all that he requires and desires. We ask, O oh God, that thou give him the opportunity, more opportunity, to live and rejoice in you. We also pray for everybody that has gathered here today that thou guide and protect each and every one of us. Lead us all home, safe and sound, to our destinations after we are done here. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. A round of applause for Reverend. Thank you so much, Reverend, for that wonderful prayer. Ladies and gentlemen, Please permit me to recognize the board of directors, Naman Dynasty. Gentlemen, you're all welcome. All right, straight into the business of the day. Please, I do not mean to bore you, but to lighten up your mood, allow me to bring on stage a wonderful singer. A round of applause for yourselves. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to welcome this patient to this great occasion. 
Me and walked me out of the Yonstrom when I came to serve and drink. Why? Ask me. That I, I, I dressed seductively to seduce him. <laughs> and who is she again to deal with? Ask me, yo. Ask me. You know, there's something really awful about that girl. What do you mean? I really can't place my hands on it, but I don't think she's who she claims she is. But don't worry, time will tell. Look at her. I'll be right back. Olivia. Olivia. Ma. And what are you doing at? Nothing. Now go about your duty. Yeah.
on the existing protocol, I want to thank you for coming to celebrate with me and my family at this momentous occasion. The journey has not been easy, yet we made it to this point. First of all, I want to thank God Almighty for his strength and wisdom. I also want to thank my amiable wife, Emilia. Emilia has been there with me from the very beginning. <laughs> Sweetheart, once again, thank you. I also want to thank the Board of Trustees and the Board of Directors for their effort and hard work. They have actually done so much for the growth of my companies. Thank you very much, gentlemen. My gratitude would not be complete without extending it to the workforce, my employees. You people are wonderful. Thank you very much. As we all know, in life, there is time for everything. I want to formally announce to us that I am going on retirement. It's not because I am tired or weak, no, but because it is a relevance in the Namanese dynasty. The time has come for me to step aside and allow the next generation to continue and take the dynasty to even a greater height. I want to formally introduce you all to my son, Dillian. Son, 
the bulk of leadership will soon rest on your shoulders. And I expect nothing but the best. We have never failed. And I don't expect you to fail when the time comes. I have sent my letter of retirement to the Board of Trustees, intimating them of my compulsory retirement. I have also forwarded your name as my worthy replacement. <laughs> However, that letter takes effect in two months. Within this time, you are supposed to present a wife. Oh, yes. Because you know that in our family, no one has assumed that exalted position without a bride. Yes. Okay, that's it. That is one of the important requirements you must fulfill as someone build to take over the affairs of the dynasty. Son, yes, daddy. you have to be very careful choosing someone who will stand with you on this journey. Because to a large extent, she will help to build or destroy what has been built already by your forefathers. Nevertheless, I am very optimistic that you will do even better than myself. Mm. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, on this note, I want to thank you again for your time. God bless you. So he had to fly 6,000 kilometers for this. But to get a branch, we could have as well, as well got him one from there. Is this what we came here? How could that be? Could? Yes. Oh, shoot. Nikki, of course. Hey, 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 hey. I want you not to mention anything when it comes to me. I need it. I'll stop. You were taking a call last night. Both of you were talking. <laughs> I see you're surprised. I know you both are into each other. You love each other. Hey, hey, okay, okay, okay. Hold on, um, This is different, okay? Mm -hmm. Nikki is a jockey, and she cannot make a good wife. Good. Yes. Now tell me, my very good friend, Ilian, who is going to be? Your wife. Um, um. Hey, Billy, you're here. We have been looking all the way for you, but here you are. So, what's up? You see? Hey, Billy. I will be outside waiting for you. Hey, 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 hey. Is that yeah. even necessary? Very. Necessary. Thank you. Awesome. 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 Dillian, um, would you like me to get you anything? You know, something to just cool the temperature. Hmm? I'm fine. Excuse me. Um, Dillian, um, you know. That on of course I did. <laughs> of course I did. For once she did something very reasonable. <laughs> Thank you. It's high time she started respecting people around the And I needed to tell her that this place is not her father's house. Of place. course. <laughs> Thank you very much for doing exactly what I had in mind. <laughs> you girls are not. But, Olivia, what? I wish you knew, eh? You would have added it, mixed it with pepper. 
and acid, then you pour it on her so her face will burn. Yeah, now. Ah. Even though she's already doing Pazaki. I'm not ready to go to now. I'm not ready to go to prison. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, I feel for my dearly baby. What have you done to deserve such misfits beside you? Huh? In this beautiful location. What? Huh? My baby, you honestly do not deserve that girl. Jeez. <laughs> you don't. I feel so sorry for you, baby. But don't worry. I am always here for you. And I who will... should have been beside him? Me, of course. Okay. Madam Charles, mm -hmm. are you not tired of this, your, your, your self-defeat and denial? Ask her. Are you not tired? <laughs> no long talk. In a few months' time, we shall mm. see who will be the new Mrs. Tilion Chikwemeka Chikesili Naman. In few months' time, then. <laughs> In few months' time as well. Found me what I'm calling busy oh. body. Yeah. Okay. This is very funny. All this drama every day is funny. Yeah. The drama is falling in your body. Oh shit. There is no shit here. It's all me. I mean, don't tell me you don't like what you see. Oh, come on, Richie. Why is you in the mirror with him? Me, good. <laughs> I mean, we are lovers, and we should start getting used to each other and do things that lovers do. Don't you think so? But we aren't lovers, and we shouldn't start getting used to each other. Right now, what I want you to do for me is leave. Are you sure about that? <laughs> Come on. Am I not beautiful? Sexy. Yeah. And how about you let me take all the fantasy? I mean, let me take you to Cloud Nine and bring you back, baby. I was in the cloud for over six hours. But right now, what I want to do is just lay on my bed and rest. You want me to rest with you? <laughs> okay, that sounds great. Mm. Okay, just turn if you're going to rest together. Yeah, I can just guide you through it. Okay. Yes. Okay. <laughs> so how do you just, want it? Just the I'll take the lead, mm -hmm. and I'll show you how I want it. I like to go up to it first. Then I will unwrap it myself. Put it on like this. Yeah, this is very funny. All this drama uh. every day is funny. Yeah, the drama is for the neon. For the neon. For the neon. For the neon. What is it? This girl's not busy, buddy. Send action doesn't work. The mark that for Sean is old because nothing. Nothing, and you're here. You should be in the room with Dilly. He doesn't want me. What do you want me to do? What did he do? He sent me out of his room. Did you do everything I asked you to do? Of course I did everything you asked me to do. I did even more. I did everything. We need to act fast before we lose him to another woman. So what do you suggest we do? 
It's too early to run out of option. I'll figure something out. But first, go to sleep. You needed to have seen the way he treated me like I was a nobody. Seduction doesn't work no more. That for sure is old. Because men are now wiser. If you want to win a man, baby, try and be yourself. No games at all if you fail. Just come in. Hey, Laura. Hey, girl. How are you? I'm fine. How's it been? Come on. Mm. How are you? I'm good. So, did you drop this? <laughs> no. Okay. I came in a while ago and I saw this flower. The other day, it was a portrait of me. And you have no idea who is doing all that? Not at all. Perhaps you've got a secret admirer. Secret what? Yes. You're surrounded by ladies. <laughs> <laughs> and now that's creepy and unacceptable. Really? Yeah. Welcome to Namani's estate. You're welcome. <laughs> it's so funny. It's funny, bro. You're surrounded by ladies. Anyway, Mama's been asking of you, so. Really? Yes. How about you go check up on her? Okay, I'll do that later. I forgot this out. You need to. <laughs> <laughs> you need to. You have a secret, and I'm coming. Shush it. Secret right. words, my fault. Okay, not for this one. It's for Dinia. It's for Dinia. It's for Dinia. This girl's not busy, buddy. Sir. Have you finished the job? Ah, yes, sir. Ah? Hope you you did a good job there. Yes, sir. You can go and take a look, sir. No problem. I I I, I trust your work, eh? Take. <laughs> Thank you, sir. No problem, eh? I'll be on my way. I'll call you whenever I need you, eh? Okay, sir. Okay. Good morning. Good day. You sent for me. Yes. Sit down.
How is it going with my son? Oh, Delium. It's not going on well. Don't you know how to seduce a man? I do. I do. So? Mom, Dillion is a hard nut to crack. I mean, I've done everything humanly possible, but he's not giving in. He, he even asked me not to come to his room at night. He said that? Yes. Uh, I think you should pick your call. Uh, no. It's, it's not important. That can wait, Mom. Okay. Um... All right, no problem. I am gonna talk to my son. Hmm? Okay. Because I mean, this this should not be happening. <laughs> All right, no no problem. Okay, mom. Mm. Can I go now? Yes, please. Okay. 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 Yeah. Ah, diamond. Sorry. Um, one second. Could you sit, sit? I just remembered something. Oh, okay. I didn't see your parents at the get together. Uh, didn't you extend the invites to them? I gave you invitation cards for them and I didn't see them. What happened? Uh, I did. I, I invited them. So what happened? Uh, uh, my dad, he traveled out of the country and m my mom has been really busy, caught up with some activities. Yeah. Hmm. Well, I can understand that, but you see, when two people are going to get married, the entire family is actually getting married. So it's nice for all the family to begin to, you know, relate and communicate. And the more we communicate, the more we get to know each other. And your parents should know, you know, that we are interested <laughs> in their daughter. <laughs> huh? Of course they do. Yes. Um, okay, I'm going to invite them again. Mm. And this time, Mm. The show gonna come. Oh, well, they have to. They have to. It's a must. Yeah, it's no. It's, it's a must. They must. They must come so we can see them. All right. Yes. There we go. All right. That's all. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Friend. Come on, you can't say something like no, that. No, 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 you are, no, you're not a good friend. I mean, Dillian, <laughs> how could you, how could you have this? Uh -huh. And I've not been here all these years. <laughs> Dillian, how could you have all of this? And I've not been here all these years. <laughs> no, Dillian, you're come not on. a good friend. Come on, Oscar, you've never said you wanted to be to Africa until now. Dillian, what are you waiting for? Uh -huh. Bondo okay. me. Oh, really? Repackage me. Okay. Bring me down here, Dillian! Okay, no, Without this! I'll do exactly that next time. Dillian? Yeah. There will be no next time. <laughs> With this, this is my new Alabama. Okay. Dillian! Yes. This is beautiful. But you know what, Dillian? I am not going back. What am I going to Alabama to do? This is my new Alabama. I have come to stay. Oh, yeah. Thank you. I know you like to have a seat. Juice in public. <laughs> what a good Alabama. Juice just, in public. Just have a seat, but let me have my drink back. Let me have my... Come on, come on, come on, come on. Give me my drink. The Leon. Oh, mm -hmm. Do you have to take the glass now? Mm. The this Leon. Is, this is really nice. The Leon. Mm -hmm. Ah. Yes. Ah, this is really good. This is really nice. Olivia? Olivia? Sir. You know you don't really have to wait here, right? Sure. Sure. Yeah. Look at this. Look at this. Look at all of this. Hey, let's chill. Let's chill. Okay, see. See. See, um, there's something that I really want to um, share with you. You know, every time I wake up, I wake up to a gift in my room. It's either inside my room or by my door. I don't know who's been sending me gifts. I've asked my sister. She says she's not the one. 
Wait a minute. Yeah. You wake up in your room. Mm -hmm. Gift in your room. Mm -hmm. Gift at your doorstep. I kidding us, bro. You do not know who the person is? It's all. You don't have to worry. That is why we have all scouts from Alabama here. I will be your CIA. <laughs> Give me time. Very little time. But Oscar, Oscar, see, on the most serious note, I can't really wait to find out who the person is. I am telling you the same thing. Relax. Sit. Fold your hands. Mm -hmm. Oscar from Alabama, we do the findings for you. Okay. Little time. I trust you. Little time. I trust Aha, that reminds me. Okay. Let us go to the poolside. Let me see how long you can stay under the water. Is that a challenge? Call it whatever you want. Challenge? Whatever. Let us go to the poolside. Let me see how long you can stay under the water. <laughs> Oscar, remember I still have my oxygen intact. While you've exhausted your zone, booties. Booties of Alabama do not take strength. Uh, you I... do not know that? Booties from Alabama do not consume strength. They <laughs> give strength. Are you kidding me? Booties from Alabama, they give strength. Let me show you the strength I am talking about. Poolside underwater. Hey, hey, see, 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 guy, I wouldn't be the one to send you to your grave. Aha, uh aha. -huh, uh -huh. Someone is backing out. Are you kidding? Someone is backing out. I'm backing out. Poolside. Okay, challenge then. Poolside. Okay, let's go. Leon. Oh, 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 oh. So many fall in love, but with the wrong one. While some have given up and say love is weak, different experiences, diverse testimonies. But the truth remains that love is beautiful. Even when you're faking it, it won't last for so long. True love is so natural, and nothing can correct it. When you try to fake it, how long can you hold on? True love is the ultimate, and that's all I know. Then you fall in love, then you fall in love over again. Have you seen love is beautiful? Love is beautiful. Have you seen love is natural? Love is natural. When you find someone, when you find someone, you understand the heart. When you fall in love, you go fall out. So many fall in love, but with the wrong one. While some have given up and say love is weak, different experiences, diverse testimonies. But the truth remains that love is beautiful. Even when you fake it, it won't last for so long. True love is so natural, and nothing can correct it. When you try to fake it, how long can you hold on? True love is the ultimate, and that's all I know. What did she say to you? She asked how things are going between Dillion and I. Mm -hmm. And I told her, but that is not the case. What is it? She asked me about my parents. And she ended up saying we should arrange a meeting between both families. She did? Why are you sounding surprised? I mean, are you not supposed to be the master planner? Are you not supposed to put this into consideration? Listen, I already did, okay? Don't worry, I'll fix it. You'll okay? fix it? What would you do about the fact that this woman already knows who my supposed father is? I said do not worry, okay? Okay. <sighs> mm. 
One more thing. What? I think I mistakenly dialed Charles's number. You did what? Are you out of your mind? So in spite of my warning, and even smashing your phone, you went ahead to call that boy. Are you okay? I, I just told you, I, I mistakenly dialed his number. I wanted to huh. call someone else and then I ended up dialing his number. It I wasn't see. intentional. I see. Now that expensive mistake will never happen again. Give me your phone. Give me your phone. But it was a mistake. Rubbish. You can set them up, but do not entrust them with your business, else they will ruin it. Yes, come in. He oh. says, Yes, sir. What is this I hear? That you're giving diamond attitude. Don't you want to get married again? Of course I want to get married. Need I remind you that you have limited time to make that happen? Okay, why is everyone concentrating on me? It's not as if Laura here is even married. Do you want to relinquish your rightful position to Laura? Should I start to pressure her to get a man? What is even wrong with you, Dillion? What's wrong with you? I mean, Diamond is a pretty lady and I believe that she will make a good wife. Why don't you just give her a chance? I mean, if on the other hand she doesn't meet up with our expectations, then we can look elsewhere. I'll think about it. There's no time to think. You make it happen. Okay, I'll try. The word, I will try, or the sentence, I will try, is not in the Nnamani's vocabulary. I will. Okay, I will. I will. Good. Anything else? Nah. I love you, Mom. Love you too. Mm -hmm. I have to run along. Okay, let me just run along. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Laura, why are you not thinking about a man? Yes. Thank you. 
Yes, yes, sure, please come in, please. Welcome, sir. Yes, can I get you something to drink? No, no, no. I'm fine, thanks. Okay. I want. Hi. I know you and I started on the wrong foot. Oh, please, come on. It's not your fault, I totally understand, okay? So. Okay. Okay. Dina, it's in a restaurant of your choice. A dinner. Mm -hmm. Are you asking me out on a date? Yeah, sure. Okay. Of course. <laughs> yeah, sure, sure, yes. All right. Okay. So I, I guess I'll see you soon. Oh yeah, yes. See you soon. To know why and what the dinner date is for. But that cannot happen now. My dear, it is happening already. We have lost out. Speak for yourself, Jane. Because Chelsea is still very much in the race. <laughs> but if anyone should have a shot at Dillion, it shouldn't be that stupid girl. Her father is Chief Magnus Dilibe. She can't be stupid to have a father that is that rich. <laughs> Has anyone seen any of her family members around? Oh, why do you care? What if she's not what she claims to be? Oh, please. Dora, I don't know what you're insinuating, but all I know is that she has taken the man we all have been fighting to have. <laughs> nah, that is all. Like I said before, I am still very much in the race. Right? You don't care. What are you going to do? Watch me. Chelsea. Am I coming back? Come back, Oscar. Come back. Come back. What did you take me to? Where on earth? Did you You like it? If I like it. Oh, good. I love it. Oh, my God. Oh. That means I passed the test. Of course. 101% you passed the test. Oh, my God. Dillion would hastily make you his wife. Yes. What did you say? Dillion would hastily make you his wife. You know why? What? My friend Dillion, he likes women that are good, that can ding ding, that can dung dung. That means I'll soon be Mrs. Dillion. Oh yes! Mrs. Oh Dillion. Say that again. Ah, Mrs. Dillion. Again? Mrs. Dillion! <laughs> Thank you very much, Oscar. Thank no, 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 no. Mm -mm. That is where you get it wrong. You don't call me Oscar. You call me Oscar from Alabama. Oscar from Alabama. No. You're still getting it wrong. With all the energy you just, you just gave me. That is what you used to pronounce it. Oscar from Alabama. Oscar from Alabama. Oh, you're still getting it wrong. Are you sure you want to be Mrs. Dillion? I will change my mind. I will change my mind. Okay, I'll get it right. I'll get it. Say it again. Oscar from Alabama. Oscar from Alabama. Good. Very good. Thank you, Mrs. Dillion. Mrs. Dillion. Mm -hmm. Where is Alabama from? USA. Oh! <laughs> fucking essay! You fucking essay! I got it. You got it? Mm -hmm. You passed it! Mrs. Dillion. Mrs. Dillion? Mrs. Dillion. What is it? 
You should come. Oh, call me Oscar. Oscar. From Alabama? From Alabama. Oscar. Oscar. See Oscar come. Oscar come. When we in a man, baby, try and be yourself. No games at all. If you fake it, you break it. They for me. For me what I'm calling busy body. Yeah. What? <laughs> Nothing. I insist. Well, um, I'm just happy, you know, seated here with you in one of the biggest restaurants in the city. <laughs> yeah, just happy. Am I such of an asshole? An asshole? Yeah. Uh, no, really. <laughs> No, you're not. So tell me all there is to know about you. Well, I... I've told you everything. There's really nothing much to know about me. There is nothing you don't know. <laughs> so, why do you love me? Love? Who's talking about love here? I, I thought you, except it's a farce. Of course I love you. I mean, who wouldn't love you? Look at you. You are, you're cute. You're tall. You're dark. You, you, you have everything it takes to attract a sensible woman to yourself. So. I... Oh. Mm. I think I'm, I'm, I'm pressed. You okay? Yeah. I'm okay, I, I need to use the restroom. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Yeah. I think down that the restroom okay. there. Yeah. Hey, what's up? <laughs> no, 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 nothing much. I, you know, I just... I'm currently in Nigeria, actually. Um, just um, a few. Yes, exactly. I'll be back. I, I don't know. I can't really say for now, but probably when I'm back in the UK, I'll give a call. Okay. Um, okay. <laughs> uh, are you kidding me? Oh, okay, you know what? Can I call you back? Yeah, I'll call you back shortly. <laughs> you done? Yes. Which means? We have to head home. Yes. We just got here. I thought uh, that's I all you wanted. Of course. I love it. Uh -huh. You said this whole setup? Yeah. I love it. Uh, but, but I'm not I'm not padded. Oh. oh. Yeah. Oh. We, don't, we don't want such embarrassment, right? Yes, yes, yes. So, so, so yeah. sorry. We have to leave him. Exactly. Okay, what about the... The bill? No, okay, I'll just figure it out. Yeah. Yes. So, so, okay. Oh, I'm so sorry. No, no problem, it's fine, it's fine. You need me to cover up for you or uh, something? Is it, 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 is it flowing already? Yeah, it's flowing already. Okay, it's for Dinia. It's for Dinia. For Dinia. Yeah. This girl's not busy, buddy. Busy, buddy. Said action doesn't work no more. That fashion is old. Because men are now wise. If you want to win a man, baby, try and be yourself. No games at all. If you fake it, you break it. They farming, they farming, farming what I'm calling busy body. Yeah. Yeah. How did it go? Not so good. 
What's happened? I keep seeing him everywhere. Who? Charles, of course. I don't know if this guy has a human tracking device that monitors me everywhere I go. Like, I, I don't even know his problem. Did he see you? Not really. But sincerely, I am not going to lie to you. I am tired. I am tired of this whole thing. I am tired. I am tired. You can't be tired. We still have a long way to go. Hmm? You have to deliver Dillion to us. I mean, we need to take over this empire. I mean, look at his life, look at the money and everything. Don't you want to keep enjoying this life? I want to. Good. But I just want you to see reasons with me. If it's for chess. Don't worry. I'll handle it. <laughs> hey, Dilly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you done eating out with your girlfriend? Yes. So soon? Hmm. Oh. Or you did that just to make me feel good, right? <laughs> Come on, no. Not really. Actually, she asked that I would leave the restaurant. Why? Um, because our August visit all came call. Ouch. Yeah. So sorry about that. Hey, come on. It's fine. <laughs> I can see you're busy with one of your favorite things, which is sketching. Sketching. I have been going around collecting beautiful images mm. in the estates. They will translate to cash when next I attend the New York exhibition. That's a regal new business, Laura. <laughs> <laughs> you know I love money. Actually, you do. <laughs> Not like you say, oh, brother, please, can you give me some pounds? Can you give me some pounds? <laughs> I'm giving you any pounds. Make your cash. Now. Really? Yes, really. I'm still the baby girl of the house, so. <sighs> She's beautiful. Where did you get this from? In the estate. Which estate? here in Namani's estates. She's a gardener, I think. And why are you asking? She... She's beautiful. Yeah, she is. She is. Where can I see her? I don't know. You like her already? Um... <laughs> no, no. I, 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 mm. no, 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 I mean, you do. No, 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 listen, you listen, do. no, 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 listen, listen, listen. She, <laughs> she's cool. I mean, the, the sketch is cool, you know. Anyway, never mind. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Um, do you mind if I ask you for something? Yeah, go on, sure. Can I keep it? Please. Yes, you can. Thank you. <laughs> you can anything for you. Thank you. You're welcome. <sighs> oh. I'll see you later. All right. Yeah. You can.
You smell heat, heat with alumo bitter. <laughs> where, where, what can you come here? Eh? Does this place look like a bar to you? Yeah, a bar This is the prestigious Naman estate. Do you know you're embarrassing me? <laughs> me? Embarrassing you. You first embarrass yourself by coming to a place where you have no business with. Huh? I'm looking for diamond. <laughs> it's funny. You have you have a girlfriend that lives in this estate. <laughs> Paulinus. Yes, ma'am. What's going on here? Who is he looking for? I don't know. And you couldn't ask him? I don't know. Who is he looking for? I'm looking for Diamond. Hey! Diamond? Yes, Diamond. I'm looking for her. Visitor. Mm. A visitor. I mean, who could that be? I don't know. You should come see for yourself. Visitor. Okay, you can go. I've heard you. You should come see for yourself. Oh, please leave my sight. I've heard you. But you should come now. Seems you both have a lot of catching up to do, so I'll leave you to it. So, so this is where you're hiding, Charles. What are you doing here, and how did you get to find me? I told you you can never hide from me. I told you. What are you doing here? Rubbish. What I'm doing here is none of your business. What are you doing here? Listen, mm. you have to go. You have to go right now. Me? Yes! Go. After the distance to this place, don't know what you're talking. I'm hungry. Get me food. Just, just please. I, I beg you in the name of God, in the name of anything, please. Just, just, just go, please. You, you, you can't come here now. What are you doing here? You, you can't I just arrived. Why no. the rush? Why no. are you rushing me? No. You have to go. You have to go. You Why to go. are you rushing me? Just what is wrong with you? <laughs> Baby. <laughs> I've been looking for you. I've been looking for you too. And who's he? 
Hey, um, you, you know what? I actually wanted to come to your room mm -hmm. to tell you that my um, my brother came visiting. Oh, your brother? <laughs> yes. Yeah, I can never see the resemblance. You can see the yeah, resemblance. Yeah, you can see the ah, I look at, look at this skin color. Yes, yeah. <laughs> You're welcome. We look alike. Yeah, yeah, um, thank you, partner. No, no, Dillion. Ah, uh, okay, Dillion. <sighs> I'm Charles. Oh, Charles. Nice to meet you, Charles. Uh, same here. Yeah, you're welcome. Um, have you shown him around the estate? Uh, no, baby, come on. That would be necessary. You know, he just came to pass a message, and right now, oh, okay. he's about leaving. Uh -huh. uh, no, 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 no. no. <laughs> I would love to see what the legendary Namadi estate looks like. Uh -huh. oh. I've heard so much about it. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> it's a pleasure, actually. <laughs> uh, Diamond, yes, baby. Why, why not show him around the estate? Uh, yes, and, yeah. and of course you're always welcome there, okay? Yeah, Just settle okay. in, I'm sure she's going to entertain you very well. There are lots to drink and eat. Thank you very much. Yeah, yeah. and uh, please, Thank when you. you're done with that, I'd like to see you. There's something I want to show you. Oh, okay, the love of my life. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> you're welcome. Settle in, please. Uh, I'm going I, um, okay, when, when you're done, sorry. <laughs> my brother. Can I yes. have more? I mean, Mr. Let me So, this is your room. My room? Yes. Oh, don't you like it? <laughs> of course I do. <laughs> I love it already. I mean, it's, it's chilling. Yeah. Okay. Um, do you want anything? Food. Mm. Yeah, food, food, food. <laughs> okay, I'll make that available. <laughs> I like that. I like that. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, so relax while I run this special errand for you. And it is my pleasure to inform you that this is a special season in this estate. Okay. And I promise you will enjoy your stay here. <laughs> I like the sound already. Mm. <laughs> I will enjoy my stay. That's nice. Okay, uh, I'll be right back. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Feel free? Oh, no, no, of course. <laughs> thank you. Right. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> thank you. Come here, where you know our plans. How? Your sister, what are you talking about? I'm equally very much surprised. I don't know how he got to find me. Now tell me the truth. Did you give him the address to this place? How? Have you forgotten you seized my phone? How am I supposed to have achieved that? I was even surprised when they called me to tell me that uh, uh, he came looking for me. I did not send him any address, so... That boy is a demon. He has come to scatter my plans, but I won't let him. Never! So what do you suggest we do? What do we do? Because I know Charles. Charles will start gallivanting and showing himself around. And we don't want that. He needs to be stopped. Where is he now? He's in one of the visitors' room. Now listen, I don't want to see you anywhere close to him. Did you hear me? Did you hear me? Okay, okay. Now take me to him this minute.
<laughs> yes, I'm here. And as you can see, I'm having the fun of my life. Mm, I see that. Anyways, enjoy yourself. Because this would be the last meal you would have in this estate. Why? Because you would be on your way out after eating. Mm. Mm. I know you never liked me. I just started dating your sister. Yes. But you see this place I am? This is the best thing that has happened to me since I was born. You can see the kind of food I'm eating. <laughs> and you want me to leave so soon? Uh, no now, madam. <laughs> no now. <laughs> Just would leave. And that is not debatable or negotiable. Is that clear? Why are you so desperate about me leaving? Is that something you're hiding? Hiding? Hmm? Just what is your problem? I mean, does this place look like your father's house? Don't you want to go back to your father's house again? Does this place look like your father's house too? Does it? Is what this you your want? father's house? What do you want? What I want? Yes, like money. How much do you want? You really want to pay me off? Damn it, mister. Answer me. How much do you want? Mm. Okay. Since you want me to leave so urgent, I hope you're ready to part with 20 million. 20 million what? Oh, I always asked for little. Mm. Did you just say that is little? Who on earth carries such money around? Who? Find it. Find what? Find 20 million. Charles, maybe you're not getting it. Are you in any way thinking that we've hijacked this dynasty? I mean, where do you want us to get 20 million naira from? Okay, fine. Me and you, you know, as man no man, based on one or two, how much will you don't give me for your life, your entire miserable life? How much will you don't give me? Have you seen 20 million naira before? Enough. You would get the money. Would you want to get such money? Mm. How do you want to get it? <laughs> That's nice. You have one week, hmm? Just one week to make that happen. Okay, right? Yes, sir. I'm on Pichuku. The chief security. Yes, sir. Here. You can have it. Do you know her? Yes, sir. I know her. What's her name? Her name is Chizitelo. Say that again. Chizitelo. Chizitelo. Oh. That's an interesting name. Can I have it back? Yeah. So, she works here? No, sir. She's not an employee here, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. She only comes here whenever she's in need of money. And when I need extra hands. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah. What was the last time she came here? It's been long, sir. So, any contact address or something? I have no idea, sir. Sir, yeah. hope she hasn't done anything wrong, sir. No, no, not at all. Far from it. <laughs> Don't worry. Thanks for your time with me. I appreciate it. Thank you, you, sir. We'll go back to you. Yeah, thank you. So many fall in love, but with the wrong oh, one. While some have given up and say love is weak, different experiences, diverse testimonies, but the truth remains that love is beautiful. I've served him food already. And why are you smiling like he came to see you? <laughs> <sighs> 
You know, I've never liked that diamond of a girl. Sometimes I feel she's not real. And how do you mean? There is something fishy going on. Although I'm yet to place my hands around it. But I believe with the arrival of this her so-called brother, the truth is not far-fetched. Mm. So you're trying to say he's not Diamond's brother? Be careful of what you say around here, Odora. Before you lose your job over something that is none of your business. Dillion is my business. Uh. Yes. <laughs> and so long as this whole thing is connected to me, it is my business. Again. Go. Oh. Continue making it your business. Yes, I Don't will. Don't mind your business. I will mind my business. My lady, the car is ready, shall we? Okay. Right. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> That's so sweet of you. Thank you. Thank you. Son? <laughs> You're here already? Yes. I can see you're having fun. Oh, yes. This is the only same thing I do since after retirement. All right. It's a beautiful sport, actually. Mm. Yeah. And that if you work hard enough, you can become a legend like Tiger Woods, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Don't get me wrong, that of course you're a legend. But I mean, in the sport, mm. you can end up, you can become a number one like Scheffler currently. Yes, like, I want to go to the Olympics. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Um, now, talking about hard work. Is that? How far have you gone with finding yourself a bride? <sighs> And Dad, it's been hectic. Hectic? Mm -hmm. With all these girls littered everywhere. You know, that's the problem. Too many of them. What about Diamond? Uh, she's there. Dad, the, the thing about Diamond is that I, I'm finding it so difficult in accepting her. Come on, son. You don't have to let indecision come between you and what you ought to do. I called you to let you know that if you don't hurry, 
the board of trustees may be forced to vote in someone else. And I'm not sure you will like that. Whatever you want to do, please, hurry up about it. Hmm? Okay, Dad. Come on. So, can I join you? Oh, why not? That is what I will not take from you. My name is not Chica. My name is Diamond. Black Diamond. What is Chica? And by the way, what's happening in your room? I mean, what's up with your room? Are you sharing money? Huh? So because Dillion promised you marriage, that is why you have refused to have me anymore. Mm. Such is life. I hope you are aware Dillion invited me over for a drink at the poolside. You know what that means, right? The two men will have a lot to discuss. You would do no such thing. Sister, I've been looking for her everywhere. No trace of her. Um, <laughs> no, I, I, I've not. H have you tried calling on the phone? Yes, I did, and her phone is in the room. And um, um okay. <clears throat> anyway, sorry for the disturbance. <laughs> no, 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 it's okay, it's fine. Yeah, and um, I okay. hope they're treating you well here. Yeah, I'm fine. I, I'm comfortable. Oh, I, nice. I I enjoy the place. Oh, fantastic. And it reminds me of my home. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, you okay. know, I have this kind of luxury in my house. I see. Oh, you are the brother now, yeah. So yeah, the older brother. Oh, the older brother. Yeah, of course, because I used to the luxury then. I'm telling you, yeah. <laughs> I see. I mean, it's come up with us. No, no problem. I will leave you to rest. Probably we'll catch up later tomorrow, or maybe some other time when you find time. Yeah. That would be bad. Oh, okay. Good night. Okay. Good night. If you see her, tell her that I'm looking for her. Huh? It's me. Okay. Okay. Good night. Okay. Good night. Yeah. Drop your head. What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? Money, man. I'm a big boy. 
Come here. Come on. Mm. Mm. Feel me, feel me, man. I'm gonna give you twenty dollars, you know. Twenty dollars. Okay, I'll make it two hundred dollars. Two hundred dollars, you know. Two hundred dollars, you know. Carry you the go. Where you want my carry on go now? Come on, I'm a big boy. I've made money. What is money? What is money? Money is nonsense. You know? Vacation in Maldives. Maldives you go. Driver, what's up? You're feeling it, right? You're my man. You're my man. You're my man. Don't worry, I'm going to give you $200, you know? Yeah, you my man, man. $200, you know? Increase the volume, increase the volume, you know? Increase the volume. And so, I they tell you. Mm -hmm. All my ladies, all my ladies, feel me, feel me, feel me. Feel me, you know? Feel me, you know? I'm gonna give you $500. Okay, $1,000, $1,000, you know? I'm a med man, you know? Yeah, yeah. Mm. Charlie, Charlie. Man, oh man, Charlie, oh no, no, no. Charlie, don't become big boy. I bet tell us, Charlie, I take up. I call you, I'll be one day. Charlie, call around, I know, so I can buy ya. You don't forget how we go deal with the press, money, nice press, 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 press. Nothing go come and sometimes you go collect that thing and make you go buy sugar. Eh? Mm. Yeah, you know, you, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, you tell us. You don't forget saying all of us did this trip. I mean, you don't go plus. Which plus? <laughs> I get mine to do plus. Which plus? Hmm? <laughs> I beg. I take on half. I beg tell us. Oh no. A miracle happened, my brother. I prayed. I fasted. God answered my prayer. He fast tracked my paycheck. I did tell you. I did tell you. Hi, Oluwa. I tell you. <laughs> Oluwa, when you want to pick my own call now, Oluwa. I did never suffer enough. Hi. Don't worry, your own tongue will reach. Eh? Oluwa, pick my call now. Oluwa, pick my call. I did never suffer enough. You go pick her. You go pick her. Hey, hey bugger. More drinks for the guys and more people pursue for the women. Hello. Hello, Charles. Hello. Who is this? Charles, where are you? Yeah, this is Charlie Ball. Charlie the Dawn. Charles, why did you leave with one of the cars? Okay, do you have my 20 million era now? 20 million? What are you even saying? Where are you? Uh, call me when you have my money ready, yeah? Thank you. Hello? Hello? <laughs> I, I, don't, I, I don't like stories anymore. If it's not money, if it's not money, forget it. If it's not money, bullshit it. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Baby. Na client, oh! Na client, oh! Jesus! Money good! Hey, Charlie, Chinuke. That Charlie, what you know? Hey! Charlie don't blow. Charlie don't blow. I beg, Charlie, I beg. Make I beg you for one thing. Make me your PA, I beg. My PA? I don't suffer. He wants to be my PA. <laughs> we are here. He wants to be my PA. <laughs> we are here. Anyway, you know, that position is a very sensitive one. Mm -hmm. eh? yes. I will think about it. See, Ch Charlie, Charlie, me, eh? Me, I don't get time for PA. If I want a woman. <laughs> My young, my young, you stay home for night. You talk to my, you don't point my girls. Eh? No get fear. Bad girl, this guy go pay for a drink, eh? I no pay you own again. No, 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 no. Nah, play they, they don't play with you. Charlie, why they do like this? You know what my woman? No, my carry woman, give me drink. I know, I know. Since I'm going to talk of Millie, you they talk of woman. No, you don't, you don't carry woman again. No, I don't do. Hear my girl, hear my girl. You know what he tell you? You know they use broke man do friends with benefit. Wow. He's here, he's here. Drink up, drink up, drink up, girl. Hurry, 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 oh! My man, my man.
drink. If you, you want two cartons, I will give you today. Right, right, bring, bring drinks, cartons, drinks. If you get all of them, bring them. Make we bust cartons. Now once person get life, you know this life no day two, my brother. You know day two. Now one. Enjoy now, enjoy now. Why? I'll Charlie just cash out like this. We go shut down. Who am I? I want it. I want it. Drink up, drink up, eh? It doesn't come by all the time. Drink, drink, drink. Oscar. From Alabama? Say it. From Alabama. Good. Alabama? What is it you want to say? I've known it from you. I've known it from you. Dylan has not even looked at me, talk more of bringing me to his room. You told me that he was going to that he was going to marry me. Up to now I've not heard anything. Are you even sure you're you're, you're talking to him about me? You hurt me? You hurt me? Oscar from Alabama does not say what he does not know. Dillian loves you. He has already told me. I've told you time and time again. Dillian is for you and no one else. Do you understand? How, 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 how come I'm seeing him with Diamond all the time? I have heard Diamond telling our chief of staff that Dillian has fallen for her. Dillian has fallen for Diamond. For Diamond? Oh! <laughs> for Diamond? Yes. What is Diamond? Who is Diamond? Compared to you? Don't even say that again. Listen. Dillian was meant, was created, was built for you. Know that. Listen. My friend is a very tactical person. Forget his innocent look, his calm look, his handsome look. Very tactical, very smart. He's looking at you. Diamond is nothing but a temporary sight. You, Mrs. Dillian, you are permanent sight. What did I just say? Permanent sight. You're not saying it without the boldness. You're not saying it like you mean it. Say it like you want Dillian. Permanent sight. Good. Very good. So you see, do not look at my friend like that. He's a very tactical man. He is my childhood friend, my bosom friend, my very good friend. Very smart. Do not capitalize on his look. Very calm, very quiet, very handsome. Forget his look. He is observing you from a distance, watching you from a distance, loving you from a distance, and he will walk from that distance to you. And he will reach out to your hands like this. And he would gladly <sighs> kiss your hand. Just like that. Are you sure? Very sure. Very, very sure. Just do your own part. I don't mind. This is Dillian. Do not doubt Oscar. From Alabama! Oscar! This girl's not busy, buddy. Send action doesn't work no more. That for sure is hard because me. What is it? What is it? Why are you disturbing my phone? Do you want to spoil the phone? You and I have unfinished business. What business are you talking about? Listen, I owe you nothing. Stella has promised to send you some money. So what is it again? That promise? That promise is as empty as my pocket right now. Until I see the Benjamin, that promise is audio. Yes. Charles, what do you want? Simple. I mean, while I wait to receive my money tomorrow, I want you to give me a parting sex tonight. You must be out of your mind. Are you okay? Charles, did I not tell you that we are done? I told you we are done. No, 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 no. 
and don't until I receive my money. And if I don't see my money tomorrow, or you coming to warm my bed tonight. Huh. I'm afraid. Your fiancé will hear everything. To be in a man, baby, try and be yourself. No games at all. If you fake it, you break it. Charles. Charles. What? Just why are you doing this to me now? What am I why doing, you doing to this you? To me now? I've been, why? I'm protecting you like a loving boyfriend. I, I, I haven't blown your cover. Yes, of course. I've not told anybody who you really are. Just why are you doing this to me? Why are you not, doing this to me? I'm not doing it. <laughs> why are you doing this to me? Why are you frustrating me? Why? 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 Are you I doing am not this? frustrating you. I mean, balance it. I'm fair enough. Come on. This is very funny. Hey, all this drama, every day is funny. Yeah. That's the drama is holding me and bodily. Yes, sir. Action. <laughs> Marry any of us. May have come to an end with the arrival of that girl. Impossible! That can never happen. Not in this. Can you imagine that small girl asking me to pick up the towel that she used in wiping her smelly mouth? Just imagine. She did it on purpose. Of course, to have a chance with my Dillion. Not in this life, not even in the next. If you ask me, there is trouble. How do you mean? Our individual plan to get Dillion, marry any of us, may have come to an end with the arrival of that girl. Hmm. Impossible. I will not allow that meet with her. to me. Come on, take a good look at me now. Hey, hey, just look at me. Full of shock. Eh? I can cook, I can sweep, I can clean, I have sense, I have in Kiruka, and a zoo to me. Come on, girls, take a good look at me now. Eh? Look at me. Eh? Full option. I can cook, I can sweep, I can clean, I have sense, I have in Kiruka, and I have a zooka to back it up. So, does that not make me a complaint? Okay, okay, okay. Don't let me lose my uh, don't, don't lose it. Mommy, Auntie, Ma, Mama. Uh, mom, please. You know me now. Is there, am I not there? I'm on this. I'm on this. Reserve of the rich, mighty, classy, and influential. Okay, okay. Hey, sister. I don't know. Ma, no, I, I will say the truth. Hey, don't touch me. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay, listen to me. Fred, Abby. <laughs> Do I know you? In every woman. Mm, every woman, yeah. Right, too. <laughs> Fred, you, you both are sisters? Yes, so, yes, so. Sister, you, you, it's, it's not your idea. It's not your idea. Oh, give my, it's an idea. It's an idea. Well, you plus sisters. It's true you want to help our family because mama and papa 
have died. No, ma, ma I'm, I'm very sorry. Please, please, please forgive me. I, I wanted to be part of this family so strongly that I had to bring my sister, whose beauty she was wasting with that guy out there. Please forgive me, ma'am. I'm sorry. So, Take this guy out of here. This way, this way. I mean, this one. What's the problem? Do you want me to enjoy this? Oh, yeah. Please, please, please. Please, please. Please, please. Please, This world, this world is full of surprises. Who could believe that Diamond, mm -hmm. Diamond is a poor riffraff for what's long? <laughs> you see, I have always known that that girl has something up her sleeves. She was just a wolf in a sheep's clothing. Thank God Nemesis has caught up with her. Oh, my poor Tillion. My Tyrion baby, see what a stupid girl has done to your emotions. I wish you never crossed your path. I wish, I wish you could just look very much deeper to see a heart, a heart that yearns for you, that craves for you. What is wrong with this one? Madness. Hey. Madness! She's going yeah. mad. <clears throat> Chelsea. What is it? Dillion asked me to call you. Really? He asked you to call me? <laughs> he sent you to call me. I mean, he sent him to call me. <laughs> Hi, Fred. Yeah, poor boy. Imagine getting dumped by someone that you see every day just because of a poor man like that. Someone will not even show up. Hey! It's oh, very just you will not kill me. Very hey. painful! This is very painful. If you want to be in a man, baby, try and be yourself. No games at all. If you fake it, you break it. For me what I'm calling busy body Yeah This is very funny for me, sir. Yeah What would you like me to do for you? Um I've been thinking lately About what sir? I've discovered the other most um competent and smart one in this estate Thank you so much sir I mean it's been years of ceaseless hard work. <laughs> oh. Good. So to add to your task in this estate, I would like for you to be my personal assistant. That if you wouldn't mind, and I hope I wouldn't be encroaching on your duties in this estate. <laughs> Not at all, sir. It is perfectly okay. As a matter of fact, this is the best news I have ever heard, sir. Really? Thank you. Yes, sir. Thank you. <laughs> Um, okay, and as for your pay, don't worry, they'll be incrementing your salary, okay? Yeah, so what you'll be doing for me is just basic things like um, you follow me, you follow me to shopping, and um, yeah, sometimes you can even do it yourself without me being there on my behalf. Just little, little basic things, 
and um, what are they, what are they, what are they, what are they, uh, yes, um, also I'll be needing your advice on certain things in this estate, my way around, okay? You have no problem, sir, trust me, anything, anyhow, anywhere, whenever you want it, I will be right there for you, sir, thank you. <laughs> you are great. Okay, starting with this minute, probably just help me get a glass of drink. Okay, sir. Oh. So many fall in love, but with the wrong one. While some have given up and say love is weak. Different experiences, diverse testimonies. But the truth remains that love is beautiful. Even when you're faking it, it won't last for so long. True love is natural and nothing can. You, but you wouldn't listen. Now it has happened, it has come to pass. <laughs> and why are you celebrating like he's proposed to you already? Ooh. He only made you his personal assistant, nothing more. So stop that rubbish. What is that I perceive? Can you perceive it? Truth! Envy, my darling. You ooze of jealousy. All right? <laughs> Listen up, darling. Listen up. Now, I have my Tilion exactly where I want him to be, which is by my side. <laughs> it hurts, right? And now, darling, I know that look, my darling, but you know what? You are not my problem because I have some preparations to do. Mm -hmm. I need to get um, new shoes, new colons, and most importantly, study hard because mm. it's not... How about Einstein? Get encyclopedia. I better get out. Oh my God, baby, you are taking easy. You know, it's not easy taking care of a man like you, so I need to study. You understand, right? Huh? <laughs> you know what? You girls get more soon. <laughs> Woo! Did you see that? So Chelsea, Chelsea has finally gotten him to herself, huh? Chelsea is only bluffing. I mean, there is no way on earth that Dillion is going to marry Chelsea as his wife or concubine. <laughs> That's not possible. But you heard her! <laughs> she was given another appointment. And so what? And so? It means that mm. if Dillion never intended them to marry, by the reason of their closeness, things will naturally, naturally begin to happen. Nonsense. Aren't nonsense. I mean, Dillion is a businessman. And you won't tell me that this is the first time he's going to be having a female as his assistant. Like... <laughs> hmm. You know what? As far as I'm concerned, I am very much in this game. No leave, no transfer. Chelsea is bluffing. Here! Yeah. Chelsea. Now, Will you stop you screaming? Know. Did I ask you to go jogging? You will take it easy now. It's very painful. Ah! But come on. What were you thinking when going on a suicide mission with Dillion? Yeah, I noticed you love exercise every morning now. Be careful now. And you decided to lie that you exercise every day. Really, Dora? Really? Yeah, because I wanted him to notice me now. Besides, I've, I've heard and seen couples that met at the gym and got married. You bought into such narratives. And <laughs> look at what you're going through. Oh, I've your legs. 
Be careful now. Don't let me slap you. Hey, it's that side that is spinning me. Just press it slow. Nobody, so. nobody saying you won't wait there so. You must shut up your mouth. You, you are even telling me to shut up. Nobody saying you won't wait there. Now you put yourself in this one. Wait. It's not true. It's okay. it's okay. I will leave this thing now. You're not doing it now. You're being wicked. It's okay now. What could they not say in my head? Don't do it. Send another car immediately to come pick her up, all right? Okay. Goodness. Uh, James, listen, you have to go to Oselenga's drive right now and go and pick up my daughter. All right? Good. Oh, good gracious me. Mom, what's with Laura? Your sister was hit by a reckless driver. What? Is she okay? She's not hurt, but uh, <sighs> the escort with her, you know, got hurt, but is receiving a treatment at a nearby clinic. Okay, <sighs> but um, what could have possibly happened? A reckless driver. <sighs> Goodness. Okay, at least it's a relief she wasn't hurt. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <sighs> my goodness. Oh. Anyway, I have to run along for my business. Where are you going to? Um, I have an appointment with Somewhere Oh. Yes. Oh. Yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> because uh, since the thing with the uh, diamond did not work out, so surely you should be on the lookout for a better replacement. Well, you can say that again. Hey, yep. Uh, see you later, mom. <laughs> Before you start to my business. <laughs> But what you're wearing, is it good enough? Are you sure you look good? Um, okay. Yeah. Bye, Mom. Bye, bye. Sir, are you are you okay? I mean. He went in happy and expectant, coming out looking like this. Okay, now what's wrong with every woman around here? I mean, how many boyfriends? No, how many boyfriends does an average Nigerian woman have? I don't understand, sir. Okay, I was in there having lunch with this lady and all of a sudden one guy, one lousy guy from nowhere just came out, dragged her out and started pummeling her. And is that supposed to be funny? Mm -mm. I'm, I'm so sorry, sir. I mean, you better be. You shouldn't be surprised, sir. This is Nigeria. Lots of shit happen around here. This is Nigeria, really? Which means I should have picked up a girl from the UK. Oh, no. That's is that what you're trying to say? No, sir. Then what? That's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is that there are lots of women down here in Nigeria. I can tell you with all sincerity that we have lots of good women here. Maybe you just haven't looked deep enough. Stop looking up and start looking down. You will realize that there is someone who is more than willing to be your wife. Really? Mm -hmm. Look, Chelsea, I am exhausted, tired. I I can't continue dinner with this. Stop. Can you stop? Stop, 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 stop this car right now, reverse. Hello. Oga, okay, what you want? I get bullets. I get fish. I get this. Oga, okay, what do you want? My name is Dillian. I've been looking for you. Sir, please, let's go. This place is not.
I know they tell strangers my name, Oga, I beg. And if you know one buy, come they go, they block my customers with that gun with they did. I beg. Even if you come around tomorrow, if you know they buy, no con here. You ain't a strictly business. Sir? How do you feel now? I feel much better. That's a good thing. I'm sorry for this. Uh, sorry for what? The accident. <laughs> Come on, mom. It's an accidental hazard. Right? So it's not your fault, so you don't have to be sorry. And it's the first time you're facing such an occupational hazard. And it's all happened because of me. I am sorry. I understand. It's not your fault, like I said. Okay? So you don't have to be sorry, ma'am. Laura. Yes, Laura. <laughs> it's okay. Don't worry. You'll be fine, okay? Okay. Um... Hey, Laura. Oh. Hey, bro. How are you? Good, sir. Yeah, good. You don't want to sit, sit, sit. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I heard what happened. And I hope you're not badly injured. Yeah, I'm doing much better now, sir. Mm. So sorry about that. If you don't mind, I have something to do inside. It's fine. Alright, thank you, sir. You're welcome. Hey, big girl. Baby sister. Thank you, I hope you're not injured. Hey. Oh, oh, I'm fine. You sure? It's just Fred. You know what about him? I'm so worried about him. Worry, we're fine. Okay? I hope hmm? so. Oh, I'm fine. So, guess what? What? Guess what? You know I'm not good with that. Okay. I ran into you. Mystery model today. Mm. Mm -hmm. You did? Yes, I did. <laughs> Bro. Mm -hmm. I think you're falling for that girl. Oh, shush it. <laughs> <laughs> you need to fall for that girl. Um, well. Well, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I, I comment my reason. <laughs> Say love is weak. Different experiences, diverse testimonies. But the truth remains that love is beautiful. Maybe when you fake it, it won't last for so long. Sorry, madam. Um, the lady who sells plantain and beans here. Oh, but a uh, woman? Yes, please. Uh, what's her? Yeah, I'm looking for her, I don't know. She was here yesterday, but I think she didn't open today. Uh, today she not come out. Why do you know? I don't know. I, I resemble her mother. I don't know. 
Um, okay. Do you... Okay, no problem. Thank you. Why did they even look for herself? Uh, don't worry. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. I'm sorry. Please. One more, please. So sorry. Do you know where she lives? I don't know. I said, why did they look for her? No one talk. I don't know. Okay, thank you. Thank you. You two ask questions. I don't know why Nigerians are too aggressive. The simple question and polite approach would do. But fine, I don't know what I'll do. Wondering what is it my friend has with this person that has no class. I mean, it is obvious she is not in your class, she's not in your league, she's got nothing to do with you. What is it you have with this person? See, see, the truth is that besides the fact that she's sweet under the sheet, uh -huh. she's <laughs> sweet under the sheet. Oh, what's wrong with you? Uh, very important. See, aside the fact that she's sweet under the sheet, she's an amazing cook. Uh -huh. Like she. She kept me away from missing home for a very long time. Uh, yes, because she made amazing uh, meals. Uh, <laughs> under the shit. Under the shit. That is the most important thing you have said. I know, right? Under the shit. <laughs> Whatever we do in life, brother, let us not forget one sweet part. One very important part. Under, under the, the shit. shit. <laughs> That's that from you. <laughs> uh. Okay, then. Yeah. <laughs> Trust me. As I the fact that she's so sweet under that shit. I like to <laughs> hear that word. Nah. Trust me, she. she no, no, I'll take your ring. The take sound away. of yeah. that <laughs> lifts my spirit. She, 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 Anything? she. She's a fantastic cook. Trust me. She's a uh, fantastic cook. Uh, yeah, uh, she made uh, amazing uh, meal that made me forget about home. Wait yeah. a minute. Wait a minute. Let it not be what I am thinking. Which is? She made your favorite. Uh, <laughs> African salad. You know the drill. <laughs> Two things you love so much. <laughs> Which are? Under the shit. Mm -hmm. African so salad. Nice. <laughs> if you know, you know. <laughs> what are we chasing to? I don't know. What... Mm. Hey, hey, come on. We, we, come on. We have to. Oh, that's not before we drink. All right. So what are we chasing to? So to. Um, um, don't say rubbish. Or, or, or better on us. I'll pour you the drink. Under the shit. <laughs> <laughs> it has to be. No, I know my friend very well. Two mm. things he doesn't play with. Mm. Under the shit. Mm -hmm. African salad. So you tell me, what have you been up to in this estate? <laughs> so what you tell me, what's been happening here? Because I know you've never been to or anything about your life.
And what's the meaning of that? Cut the pretense, Fred. I see how you've been frolicking around town with Laura. But listen, let me tell you. If that is your ploy to get me jealous, or probably running back to you, <laughs> you lie. Because I have channeled my energy into someone more beneficial. Alright? So I would advise you to change your script, or better still, change your script right there. <laughs> Alright, Chelsea. Can I take my room? Run along. By the time you will be done eating this delicious meal, you will be all mine. <laughs> let's dance and style, let's dance for a while. Heaven can wait to end the watch in the sky Hoping for the best Sir Chelsea So I made something special for you Okay By something special you mean food? Yes sir Just like the one you made when I first returned? Better than that Okay to you. No, right behind you. Ladies first. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> you, you like it? Of course, I love it. How do you know this is one of my favorite food? <laughs> Anything for you, sir. Thank you, Chelsea. You're welcome. You see, I am being my personal assistant. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. James, I brought you food. Food? For me? <laughs> yes, for you. Are you surprised? I'm surprised, Thank you. Enjoy. Thank you. You're welcome. Are you mad? You left home. Come on, get out. How can you walk? Don't walk. Don't walk. Don't walk. Don't walk. Don't walk. Don't walk. She said, I will die. 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 I I don't know. 
No, I, he's just chasing me everywhere. I didn't do anything. Okay, so what did you do? James that I know cannot be chasing you up and down like I that. I said I did not do anything. Don't you get it? I didn't do anything. You didn't do anything? Yes. So why is he chasing you? I, I, I just went to give me, me, Mr. Dino his food. Mm -hmm. After giving him his food, I came out and James started chasing me. Are you hearing what you are saying? Does it sound, does it make sense to you that James would just be chasing me? I said he is chasing me! Don't you get it? Okay, okay, he's chasing you. Chelsea, please, I love you! Chelsea! Chelsea, I love you! Oh, Chelsea! He's saying I love, I love you. you. Chelsea, Chelsea, what did you do? Chelsea, please, I love you. Open this door for me, Chelsea. Let me go and check. No, 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 I don't want more work from you now. I tell you never to bring him to my house. I'm sorry. Eh? He kept on insisting on seeing you. Eh? Today he came to the shop and said I will neither sell nor uh, uh, leave the shop. Just look at me. What power do I have to stop a man like this? Eh? I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Eh? Thank you. Let me quickly rush to the shop. I, my customers are waiting. Eh? Thank you. Please. Eh? Thank you. What do you want from me? Why do you keep looking for me everywhere and asking people about me? I can't help it. I can't get you out of my head. You now live rent free in my head. And the only way to get you out of it is to decapitate me. Then so be it. time you made an indelible imprint in my heart. Afterwards, I, I vowed to find you. This is in Namani's estate, where I sometimes work as a gardener. I know. You took the picture? No, my sister did. Who are you and who is your sister? My name is Dillion Chukwemekachi Kesebe Namani. Your Chief Bartholomew's son. Please leave. Why? Just leave. Just leave! Get out! Can you just leave? Leave! Why did you have to do something as irresponsible as to spike my food with black magic? I'm sorry, 
Despite the fact that I brought you close and I trusted you. Sorry, you sorry? Okay, what exactly are you sorry for? Sir, I don't know what came over me, okay? I guess I was just carried away by your presence and, and quest of having you all to myself. I am sorry. Sir, I promise it will never happen again, please. If you really feel my job, I don't have any other thing else to do, sir. Please, I beg you. Hey, 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 hey. And of course it won't happen again. And this means I'm relieving you of your job as my personal assistant. Sir, and I am reassigning you to the laundry department. This takes effect immediately. Better, sir. Better, sir. Better, thank you. Sir, thank you. God thank you for what exactly? Are you still talking? I'll leave. There is this. Chelsea? Baby, do you miss me? Do you like what you see? Being a bad girlfriend, okay? But I'm sorry. Okay. <sighs> Look, baby. I'm sorry, okay? I know I've been a bad girlfriend, right? But I have realized that. 
You are the best thing that has ever happened to me. And I forgive you. I forgive you for everything you've been doing with the boss's daughter. Hmm? Do you forgive me too, Papi? Do you? Freddy left. I've been waiting for you. Come on, we are going to be late. The party has started already. All right, babes, I'll, I'll join you, Jiffy, okay? You know what is going to happen? Huh? 
I'm going to go to the house, call the guy, and I'll speak to him in a manner that he will never forget in a hobby when he gets back to that stupid Alabama. Mm -hmm. Why? Why you can't take me to Alabama? Oh, I'm so
Of course, that's the goal. The beautiful. Do everything and more. You like it? Can we make a toast? Sure. I'll let you go first. What are we toasting to? To us. To us. To love. To eternity. To forever. To forever. I love you. I would believe in moments like this would come. I remember the first time meeting you, you chased me away. <laughs> you were actually very stubborn. I wasn't stubborn. I was just being a gentleman. But here I am, about to feed that same lady. That's the goal to make you blush. Yeah. Okay, okay, you know what? Uh, how about uh, I call you back in an hour? I have a serious appointment now. Hey, come on. No, that's not the case. <laughs> come on. With your jokes. Okay, okay, no, I'm serious. You know you're my love. I love you. Yes. I do. <laughs> come on, give me these nasty jokes. <laughs> Yeah, okay, 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 no problem. I'll see you. I'll talk to you soon, okay? Bye. Love you. Mwah, mwah. This is a <laughs> love. Mom, how long have you been standing there? Long enough to know that my son is in a relationship and he is hiding it from me. You're cheating on me. Hey, mom. I am no. your first love. Come on, mom. No, and how no, can no, you be in no. love and you're mom, not you know, telling me? Mom, no, no I need to cry no, now. No, 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 <laughs> don't cry. I'm sorry. No, that is impossible. So who is she? Okay. Her name is Zitel. Zitel? Is that yes. Ibo? Um, yes, Ibo. Yes, Ibo. Like uh, Cheese Zetelo. I think that's cheese like Zetelo. It. You're correct. Cheese Zitello. Yes, Zitello. you're correct. Zitello. Zitello. Oh, my Zitello. goodness. So um, <laughs> is she beautiful? Is she tall? Mm -hmm. Does she have a wide hip like your mama? Uh, I mean, what does she do? Who are her parents? Whoa, what does she leave? Whoa, whoa, Tell me whoa, everything about whoa, her. Whoa, 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 what kind of thing does she like? Mom, she... Mom, Come mom, on. Mom, 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 take some chill pills. Why? It's not a time for question and answers. Who said? 
You don't have time, son. Come on. Okay. Yes. Tell me about her. Yes, mama, you know I don't have time. You, but, but, but I'm working on it. You're working on it? Yes. What do you mean you're working on it? But I saw you like all besotted on her. You love her, right? Come on, tell me about her. I She's do. beautiful. Mama, okay, she okay, like? Mama, stop. No, 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 <laughs> oh, you've got jokes actually. <laughs> you know, I. I try to imagine how you're able to maintain this beauty despite the stress you encounter every day. So tell me, what's the secret? Um. Well, you will have to pay for the information that you seek. <laughs> and you know that I can literally do anything. I can afford it. Me? Of course. Try me. And information in exchange for your life. My life? Yeah. This man, I don't know, I've seen him before. He's been threatening my life, he's been coming for me. The one who had a gun by that door. And how is. How did I follow me up to this point? Mm -hmm. The one there by the door. If you look very well, you'll see him. Waiting then. Come on, don't keep my parents waiting, please. No, 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 of course, you know I love you. Okay, no problem. Yeah, sure, sure. Okay, love you. Why didn't you send one of the drivers to go pick them up? Considering um, the fact that she's coming with her family. Yeah, I offered to do just that then. She said I shouldn't bother that they're almost here. So, who am I to go against my babe's wishes? I have to respect her decision. Oh, uh, really? Yeah. Uh, are they the one coming? Who is that? No, that can be. Sure. <laughs> of course, that, that's a chihuahua. Maybe that's one of daddy's friends. Daddy's friends? Yeah. No. Of course, daddy should. Daddy cancelled all his appointments today for this moment. Really? Yes. 
akan dipilih. You must be Dillion. I am Dillion. Welcome to Dillion. Yes, ma'am. The song in my daughter's mouth always. Whoa. Dillion this, Dillion that. <laughs> oh, they're fine. They've been waiting for you all. Um, my sister Laura, Laura Zitel's parents, please. Oh, really? Yeah. Don't have a lot, of, uh, lot of explanations to do. She was the only intelligent friend I had way back in school. And we attended commercial secondary school together. We were the most intelligent and talented in our class back days. <laughs> and you forgot the most beautiful oh, girl. Emilia, <laughs> come here, come here, you have not changed yet. Oh you have not changed. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. And um, is that the man you married and you know, went off to America? Yeah, my husband, Chief Levi Okoye. Oh, nice to meet you, Chief. And my <laughs> little princess. Chief, how are you? How are you? Oh, good, sir. Welcome, thank you. Chief. Oh, yeah, I want my house. Yes. Yeah. You are yes. so beautiful. Just my oh, my sister. Yes. Thank you all. Thank you. Bless you guys. Oh. Yes. Holy words. I love flattery. Say that again to me. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> and you are beautiful. <laughs> please, please sit down. Ah, Emilia. Oh Juliet. Oh my goodness. Are you Chief? 
Levi of Stars Group Companies? Yes, I am, Chief. And it is an honor to finally meet the brand behind Namani's dynasty. Yeah, welcome to my house. Um, 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 sorry, please. Um, everyone, I am lost. Please. What's happening? <laughs> Babe, I know you have a lot of questions to ask. Of course, I do have questions to ask. <laughs> I'm so, so sorry for not coming clean from the word go. Uh, come, I didn't tell you about my status. You must be asking, right? Exactly. Well... I did that because I've had a lot of men come to me because of what they can get from me. And then again, it's a project for me. What sort of project? <laughs> okay. I own an NGO called Save the Girl Child. We cater for the girl child all over Africa, especially the less privileged ones. I had to take up some tasks like cleaning, hawking and selling food. Every other suffering and mundane stuff the girl child has to struggle with in this society all over Africa. I wanted to feel what they felt in the society replete with stigmatization for the girl child. I wanted to reach out to them at the point of their needs. And for me to do so, I needed to understand what those needs are and what it felt like to be a woman in this part of the world. Your sister captured me when I was undergoing one of those tasks. Um, which means you're not from downtown? Not at all. I came into the country four months ago. I'm so sorry. I needed to complete the assignment, otherwise the course will be terminated. Sorry. You know, that's some creepy stuff there. Well, um, my dear, what you're doing is very noble. And uh, you have our support. Welcome. Well, I was told the number is ready, so all are we waiting for? So let's head to the bigger living room. Mm. <laughs> so, shall we? What's yes. not you do that? Come here. Ladies and gentlemen, today is important for us as the Nomad group, as history is about to be made again. Today, I am stepping aside to hand over the pattern of continuity to the next generation. As we all know, the Namani Group is a consortium of generational growth and development. We have been putting lives for decades, which makes us the incineration of all eyes and the ending of men. Today, as the man with the largest shares in the dynasty, I crave an indulgence to introduce again to you my successor. I am talking about Iman, vibrant and energetic, full of life and ideas. A man that will give us an edge at the marketplace. A man who we believe will take the dynasty to a higher plane. I am thinking about my son, the Chukwemeka Chikizli Namaya.
you know, daddy, if I say I'm not nervous, I will lie. Of course, I am the true son of my father mm. and trust me to keep the legacy going. Death of Mary and them was here. It's such an honor for me actually to be sharing your all. And I promise that in my region, nothing, but I mean nothing, the standards here won't drop. We're going to raise the bar so high that we'll become a force for the world to recover.